Welcome back to Let's Play Wonder Boy, The Dragon's Trap. So last time I showed y'all where we were going next. I did a brief look into figuring out where armors are that I do not have that I can still get. And it looked like... Now this is the confusing thing. I may potentially just not be able to get this one right now, but we're going to check to be sure. So I'm going to go in as a piranha. And right over here, I know I've been up here like a dozen times. Yeah, there's an armor and shield here, or armor and sword here, but not a shield. Oh, um, something else that I should mention that I, as far as I can tell, was removed from the remake was in the original game, there was something called, or you had a stat called charisma, and different armor would affect your charisma. And the shops wouldn't even sell you things if you didn't have enough charisma for it. So as far as I can tell, this is it. It may, however, instead be in there. That may be it. It may not be a shop. Because we saw a couple times. That's right up there, and we won't be able to get that for a little bit. But when we do, the world will be our oyster. I shouldn't have come back, actually, because I kind of need to go back down there. Now, the last thing... There's one other thing that I need to get. That I can potentially get, I guess I should say. And that's heading back down here, and we're going across the beach next to where we exited the previous dungeon. So, that may take me a second. And that's at the far side. Oh, hey, I can break this now. Check that out in a second. I didn't buy the Master Shield! Now, what's in you? Oh, it's just a quick way back to town. That's cool. Makes my job easier. So that should theoretically be every piece of equipment that I can get right now in the game, except for the crystal armor, which is up top here, which is super expensive. I'm going to hold off on buying that for now, though. Okay, 3, 12, 35, 56. Yep, looking good. 135, wow. Yeah, I think 135 is looking pretty good. Um, 130. Yep, still looking pretty good. I'm gonna save that my money there, though. Because I'm probably going to encounter more money in here. So let's go! I could. Dang it, I fell. I have to go in the left one or you're not gonna make it. No, that's not what I want at all. Dang it. I mean, I guess. That's what the door looks like when it disappears. Where am I even going? I'm lost. Okay, let's try that again with better platforming. I just gotta go over here, and I gotta jump. That's all I gotta do. Just gotta jump. Not hard. Just gotta jump. And just gotta jump. There, and I've made it to the underground. Look at those mushrooms in the background. Holy crap. Just got rocks here. And I blend in very well with the background. I still kind of blend in with the background, but the outline does a very good job of helping distinguish.
Now, not only does Lion Girl here have a fair amount of reach, but due to the arc of the sword, you don't even have to be that precise when you're going up and down. It's super nice. Huh. But I also don't kill blue bats. In even two hits, wow, these are some tough bats. Kind of interesting that they made the they made Lion Lady here a little a little bit more brutish in the remake. Whereas in the original, I always felt like like uh, Lion Man was perhaps the most knightly, the most proper. I'm gonna stab you in the face. I'm gonna smack you in the face is what I'm gonna do. That's lava. Lava's cool. Lava's a cool guy, knows a lot of people. Only shows up at the wrong parties, though. Then everybody's like, Hey, yo, Lava! Why are you here? And Lava's like, Lol, I don't know. So who are you? I see a thing. Now, you know, there's no hint whatsoever in the original. So that's a little... It's a little bit of a help. But, yeah, there's a store here. Oh, nice. Not actually what I'm after. I was looking for a store. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put on... I'm gonna put on my dragon mail. Less armor, but, uh, lava? Lava, yo! Lava's bad news. And that's why. Ha! Oh, dang it! Dang it! Look, if I could just jump over there, this isn't hard. Gotcha, sack of poop. Am I me just gonna swim around in lava for a little bit? That's a little mean. I'm just gonna get hit by everything here. That's also cool. There, I got him. Fudge this guy, though. Not going backwards just to deal with that crap. The caves have gotten a little cooler. Oh, also because of your extended reach, you can hit things just a little bit above and a little bit below you. So, like, I can stand here and whack that guy right out of the friggin' sky. Stupid cloud. I think he runs the show. Well, he may run the show up there. But not with me down here. I want that money. Got him. I don't know if it's just the difficulty that I set. Maybe, like, default is hard or something? Like, maybe the original version of the game ran on hard. And they made two easier difficulties? I'd believe that. Because I'm honestly just kind of face smashing everything and it's working out in the end. As loyal as they were with the upgrade to this game, I do wonder just how much they changed. Mean. Quit it. Well, I can take the bottom route. Oh, I can take either route. That's cool. Hey, you come back here. So much health. Holy crap. Oh, I also can't get up. So that's cool. And then there's another one.
So it appears, though, we're making our way out of the cool exterior. And instead to what is a very weird place to have a Japanese castle. So much help. Look at that, though. They got the cherry blossoms. And you're looking back, and it, it actually looks like expansive and open, even though it's still just in a cave. Whereas here, it's just, I don't know, rocks. Hey, rocks. How about them rocks? So welcome to Lion Girl's Dungeon. Andrews. Jerk ninjas. I can barely hear the music to this area, but yeah, that's where we are. We're in a place. We don't just jump one direction either, or one distance. See, you know, one thing I like about the remake is they changed the music. Sorry. Frightened a guy, trying not to get shot in the face by a shuriken. They changed the music, though, so that the... Because all the dungeons in the original use the same music. They changed the music, so all the dungeons still use that music. But there's, like, a remix for it each time. Look at that guy. Looking at me like I'm a fool. Hey. Hey, quit that. Cut that out. Rude. Swinging that thing around. Gonna hurt somebody. Hey, what even are you guys? What do you guys even do? You have, like, no range. Can't be a samurai with that. You're not even swinging your stupid sword. Oh, or is this here? Well, blocks you could hit, but not much else. The Daimyo Temple. Oh, you throw stuff, though. That's rude. Oh, here's my music. I was wondering where my music was. Jeez, these bats. There, I got the bat. Hey, you! Shut up. There's a thing back here, and it's gone. Cool beans! Yep, that's that's the place. I don't know what this floor, multicolored floor thing is, but... We're in a place, though, now. Look at this crap. Look at how in a place we are. Man, why does everything hit so... Why does everything have so much health? I can tell where I was. I still cannot duck. I only take three hits. I mean, compared to everything else. Hey, you! Cut it out! They spawn multiple enemies at once! What do you want me to do? So I've been face tanking everything up until now, but, like, I can't even, like, take it carefully in here. So I'm just gonna wait for you. Eight hits, holy crap. Yeah, more of them blocks. At least they put a decent graphic on them so they don't look. So it's not just the same blocks you always see inexplicably floating in the air. Man, I could go for some health. Can I get just one enemy to spawn at a time? That'd be super cool. Can I get ninjas that aren't standing one block in the air? That's you're cool. You're cool. I'm gonna. Two 
two hits is cool. I can handle two hits. I can handle you when I can get you against the corner, or if I don't, whatever. I mean, I'll play your game. A little bit of health, better than nothing. I'm still going, I'm still tiptoeing. We're gonna make it. I'm just gonna go through this door. Jeez, you're going places. A little more health, even better! So then I tip down. Flying girl, tiptoeing through the Daimyo's castle. Swinging my big old giant sword! With a ring through it for some reason. I don't know what that ring's gonna do. It can't possibly be good for balance. But that's okay. I'm sure I'm using the sword more like a club anyway. I'm just gonna beat somebody with it. Oh, hey. We've made it. So they got the little white things coming down. They even kept the white things in this one. But they also have all these Japanese lanterns. Oh, it's so cool. So nice. So nice. So I don't have the health for this. And I don't remember what this guy does, so it's gonna be great. Let's go fight a boss. The Daimyo Dragon. Um. So I'm gonna die. What do you want me to do? Huh. When do I hit you? Oh, I hit you when you do that. I mean, I'm still gonna die. But, hey, you wanna do that thing again? You want to do the thing again so I can hit you? Yeah! Holy crap, he's only got not. I've hit him like four times! How much health does this guy have? Okay, maybe Lucky Sword is not great against him. Let's try... I don't know, let's try the Shogun Blade. Oh, you know what? Let's put on better armor, too. Uh, 30, 56. I'm still gonna, like, die and have to use a potion or something, but... Hey, do your thing. Whoa. Wow. Really? There has got to be some trick to fighting this guy. Because this is crazy. I'm doing one damage per hit. And half the time I can't even get near him. Yeah, this is friggin' crazy. Am, I'm, am I even doing one damage a hit? I don't know how you're supposed to deal with that. He just walks towards you and then stabs you. If you get near him, he does that crap. Yeah, I'm gonna use all my potions. I don't know what I'm supposed to do against this guy. That's great. Can't, like, wall him into a corner or anything. There's not nearly enough room to dodge the electricity orbs, especially if you want to actually hit it. Come on, hit him. Okay, come here. He doesn't actually hit you, which is hilarious. I have, like, spells. Can I use spells against you? Yeah, eat it! It does, like, no damage to you. That's cool. I'll do this all day. Yo. Yo, Bucket. I feel like this is not intended to be a sword battle. Perhaps. I'm supposed to fight him a different way. Jerk move, yo! Look, I'm just trying to... I'm just trying to stand here and not get hit by your crap. And you gotta be over there doing that.
Now the nice thing is I catch these and I can just do this all day. I mean, I'm still getting hit every now and then. Sometimes I can just, like, not even move. Just... That's cool. I like those twofers, though. That's cool, Beans. I don't know, maybe I can outlast them at this rate. Hey! I'm standing here. Do you mind? Do I have anything else I can use against you? Like, maybe I have something that does more damage or something? Magic fight! Magic fight! These fireballs do, like, no damage. Holy crap. Yeah, look at this. I gotta use, like, three of them to do one damage to them. That does a little damage, I guess. Well, back to boomerangs, I suppose. Boomerangs seem to do reasonable damage, and as long as I catch it, I effectively have infinite of them. I'm gonna take some damage, but I still have two potions to go through, so I'm not too concerned. I feel like if I've got him down to 37 so far, I've probably got this. Man, what was up with this boss? Am I doing something wrong? Was I supposed to farm for that crystal gear or something? Am I missing something important? Dude, get away. Back off, yo! Now I'm losing them because you're making me jump. Yeah, back off. You throw the crap away. So I don't know how you're supposed to fight this boss. But I found something and I'm sticking with it. Hey, we got a pattern! Just in case anybody was curious what he looked like. I did it! I didn't even have to use my potion. Give me that money. No, 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 no. Get away. I want money. Give me the monies. Oh no, I messed up! Oh! Now I'm a bird! Heck yeah, fudge you guys. I'm leaving. What's in here? So, understandably, Hawk Girl here, broken. But that's cool. Because we're at the end of the game, yo! This is our last transformation. We got things to do, places to go, people to meet. Skies to fly! Bird is so great because you can just go wherever. You can go everywhere. You can do everything. You can also press it down if you just want to fall. Yeah. Bird. Bird. Go bird. Go bird. Flying bird! 
Oh, you don't flap your arms like a madman in the remake. Here, you just go. Ah! Until next time, everyone. I'm a bird. <laughs>